Alright, All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Brady Labor back here with TriStateFootball.com. I'm here with Seth Bruns from the Dixie Heights Colonel. Seth, just kind of give me your thoughts on this big win tonight against Beachwood. Oh, I loved it. My coach said that we were going to come in this game and establish a run because we kind of been a pass-happy team. Came in here, established the run, big guys up front. Huge game, man. I love them. They're my family. They give me everything I got. I couldn't be anything without them. Okay, first quarter, you had a huge run to set up a short touchdown by Z. Kind of talk about that play. Uh, I don't know, man. I, I came out, saw an opening. I just hit the Jets. I went in. Unfortunately, I got caught, but my big man, Zeke Pike, punched it in for me. And then you had two other third quarter touchdowns. Just kind of talk about how that helped you I out. just keep, I keep trying to get stronger as the game goes on. Always stay true to my running lanes. My linemen, again, can't thank them enough. Big holes make me get touchdowns. And you're right. The offense and defensive line really dominated this game. You know, just kind of talk about that, the, uh, the, the yeah. big guys up front. Yeah, I can't say enough about my big guys, man. They're, uh, they're, they're a bunch of hardworking kids, always out there working on the field, in the weight room, getting ready. And uh, they came out tonight, had an upper hand on them, and really dominated this game. And then especially after what happened last week at Nipper Stadium, you oh, know, this got to uh, feel hard, good. Hard loss, came back. We knew we had to dominate this game. We knew we had to dominate the comeback. And uh, we're just going to keep on moving forward from this win. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's Seth Bruns from the Dixie Heights Colonels.